Live from the local station, the 10 o'clock news starts now. Emotions running high in Jacksonville Beach. More than 100 people gathering this evening to remember the life of this local father who was shot and killed. It's got to stop, you know, it got to stop with this madness and killing one another. And, you know, it's okay to walk away. You're not a coward. Leon Bennett was killed just a block away from the beach following a fight outside a bar. Now police are searching for his killer. News for Jack's reporter Eric Avanier has a message from the victim's family. As rain fell from the sky on this dreary Tuesday evening, so did tears from the eyes of friends and relatives of 23-year-old Leon Bennett, a father of two boys ages two years old and five months. He was an amazing father, Ex extraordinary father, to be honest. He was super generous, would have gave his last to anybody. He was a great father. He was a great son, grandson, brother, had a heart of gold. It's crazy amazing the amount of people that knew him, don't even know him, and, and bother to reach out and show us support. Early Sunday morning, cell phone video captures Bennett involved in a fight outside a Jacksonville Beach restaurant in night spot. Detectives say moments later, Bennett was followed to a location near the intersection of 1st Street and 7th Avenue, where he was shot to death. News for Jax has obtained the 911 call for help. Somebody was shot. Okay. Yes, hey, man, somebody shot, man. Okay, hey, where, ambulance. listen to me, hang on. Where's the person with the gun? I don't know. This surveillance video shows what appears to be the suspected gunman and other men getting into this white sedan, then driving off. Bennett's family is now pleading for people with information about the shooter to tell investigators what they know. If you do know something, hear something, whatever the case may be, please just step forward, say something to the authorities. Um, this family is hurting. And while the family is asking for people to step forward with information, Bennett's mom has a message for people who think pulling a trigger solves every dispute. It's got to stop, you know, it got to stop with this madness and killing one another. And, you know, it's okay to walk away. You're not a coward. I mean, what do you get out of spending the rest of your life in jail for killing somebody and ruining a family? Now, the family also wanted the public to know that Leon Bennett was not a gang member. They say they have been hurt by posts on social media suggesting that just because he was shot out here in the streets that he was somehow connected to gang activity, but they say that was simply not the case. Reporting live in Jacksonville Beach, Eric Avignet, Channel 4, The Local Station. Eric, thank you. Also today, News for Jacks received the 911 calls for help from that deadly Jacksonville Beach shooting. In it, you can hear the caller trying to speak with dispatch, while also trying to comfort someone in the background. You okay, bro? You okay? You okay? You okay? Is he inside or outside the business? You okay? I didn't hear you. The patient. Listen to me. The patient. Is he inside or outside the business? He's outside. We outside. We outside. Okay. I've already got officers on the way. Okay. 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 Officers have yet to announce any arrests in Leon Bennett's death, so if you know anything, call police right away. You can also call Crime Stoppers to remain anonymous at 1-866-845-TIPS.